Seidler, the owner and chairman of the San Diego Padres, has died at the age of 63. And Seidler had a huge influence not only on San Diego sports, but really within the city as a whole. And we have team coverage on the significant mark that he leaves behind on the field and off of it. Our Jimmy Chambers starts us off with his contributions to the community. Jimmy. Andrew, all day long, fans have been showing up, paying their respects to the beloved owner of the Padres, noting that he didn't just energize the team, he energized the entire whole of San Diego. We have the people in the room that can take it to the next level and win the world championship, and that's why we're here. And for other owners, that would just be another platitude. But when Peter Seidler said something like this, Padre fans listened. In 2023, the owner San Diego always dreamed of outspent every team outside of New York to acquire the best players on the planet. Fans say Peter will always be a hometown hero. Peter felt like everyone as the fans like a family, like the players family. The way we play, the way the electricity is inside the stadium, and all of this is because of him. But it wasn't always about the Padres. Seidler's charitable arm reached far, creating the Lucky Duck Foundation to curb homelessness. Also raising $18 million for the Pedal for the Cause Cancer Foundation. And in the COVID-19 emergency, it was Petco Park that mobilized to vaccinate tens of thousands of San Diegans daily. Seidler's leadership was get it done and now. Padres fans have felt that from the very beginning. And I think he brought in a uh, experienced but young mentality and a young ideas to the team. Peter Seidler was a champion in business, enabling him to continue the legacy in baseball ownership. But priority one was always his family. Fans gathered to pay their respects to someone who was willing to give it all as long as he could. Brought on a lot of sadness knowing um, how much a championship meant to this city and how over his last few years he did everything he could to bring a winner to the city. The only thing that I have to say is thank you. And even with all of his success, he was a very down to earth human being, someone that wanted to know more about you than would give up about himself. So interested, make you, made you feel like you're the only person around. Uh, that being said, the loss of Peter Seidler is impossible to calculate for the Padres, but also incalculable to San Diego as a whole. And that's the very latest from Petco Park, Jamie Chambers, Fox 5 News. Yeah, so many